Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Ashley Benet. Today's video, I wanted to break down Kim Kardashian's look on the Met Gala red carpet. She wore a Marilyn Monroe dress from uh, like a vintage look that Marilyn Monroe wore back in the 50s. And um, it's reported that Kim had to lose 16 pounds in three weeks to fit the dress. Now, I don't know about y'all, but I always was told that Marilyn Monroe was plus size. So I'm like, wow, are people just that much bigger now? Or are we wearing vanity sizing? Like, is the clothes sizes just made smaller in a tag, but we're really bigger? Because from my research, I always heard that Marilyn Monroe was a size 12. And for Kim to have to lose weight to fit into a size 12 dress, I found that kind of peculiar. And I wanted to know, so I dug, I researched, because I love Marilyn Monroe and I love... You know, I love Marilyn Monroe. I think she's beautiful, and I think that um, she's just stunning. So I loved her, and I looked up, like, all of her her old IDs and some stuff from the State Department, and they said that Marilyn Monroe was five, five and a half, and she, um, her weight in the beginning of her career was around 117 pounds to 120, and um, her measurements, she was a true hourglass figure, but even by her measurements, I think they said she was 34, 26, 34. And by today's standard, she would be like a size zero or size two. So, and I thought Kim Kardashian was a really petite person too. So when I read that she had to lose 16 pounds to fit Marilyn Monroe's dress, I'm like, wait a minute, something's not adding up here. Are we just that much bigger than people in the past? Or, you know, are these vanity sizes getting out of control? Like, do we really not wear a size 10? We really wear a size 16 in 1950? So I was really curious to see. I think that Marilyn Monroe was probably, they said at her heaviest, like when she passed, she was around 140 pounds. And um, the, the shirt that was a size 12 was from a... Um, uh, Italian designer and I know European and American sizes are really different so I'm thinking that Marilyn Monroe was actually very tiny very petite but you know rumors and you know vanity sizing and things like that prove that it's not always true because I thought Kim Kardashian was really really petite in real life and she is she's not really big um, she's short and she's not a big girl so, um, I think Marilyn Monroe was also the same. She wasn't as short as Kim Kardashian is, um, but I think she was curvy and, you know, she was pretty slim too. She's pretty petite. Uh, if you think about the average American woman's weight in 2022 and height, Marilyn Monroe was kind of petite. And you can kind of think about our grandparents, you know, um, how thin and petite they were in comparison to how big people are now. But that was just something very interesting. I didn't necessarily like the look on Kim. I appreciated her um, just admiration of Marilyn Monroe and throwing it back to her as such a figure of grace and beauty. But I didn't think she did the look any justice. I didn't think, because Kim Kardashian, one thing she's going to do is serve a look. And I don't think we really got that. But um, if you guys saw Kim and her Matt Gala look, tell me what you guys thought about it down below. And until our next video, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.